Hey, 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 floppy catters! The anticipation has been building on social media. And finally, today is the day where we unveil the cuddle clone of Charlie. Okay, wow. Here we go. So it comes kind of loose in the box like this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's see if Chiggy turns around. No notice of it yet. Charlie's very excited. Very, very excited about it. Let's see. I'm just gonna wait for their reaction. So today is Friday. We got this yesterday, Thursday. Oh, Charlie's noticed it. Wait, 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 what? Who is that? What? Is, wait, is that moving? It looks like a cat. I have to go investigate. <laughs> Bub, is that like you? Is that like you, Bubby? Bubby, you chiggy. Wait, what is that? What in the heck? So as I was saying, today is Friday, and uh, my mom came by with my niece. She was out w walking her, and I said, Mom, do you want to see um, what the latest thing is we got for Floppy Cats to product review? She's like, sure, and I was like, it's a stuffed animal of Charlie, and she's like, oh, Jenny, that's just eerie. <laughs> so she definitely thought it looked like Charlie. Okay, so it's a little bit messed up. The little blaze is messed up. I gotta get that straightened out. Okay, and then this little ribbon comes undone, and then that's when the whiskers pop out. Think. Yeah. What do you think? And then I think you can straighten all this hair and stuff. Um, I am most impressed by the back of it. The back of it is what my mom saw first and that's what she said and Jenny that looks that's really eerie <laughs> she said thank goodness he's still alive because this is weird <laughs> and then I was telling her about cuddle clones because she didn't know anything about them and she's like I, I bet I bet they're really popular I bet a lot of people get them and and I said yeah as far as I know um, I, I said I saw my first one at blog pause a gal had a dog she's gonna bite those whiskers Chiggy, it's like the kitty cat you never could have, Chiggy. The dog that somebody had at Blog Paws, it was a it was a dog blogger that obviously had it, and she let me hold it and stuff. And it, I don't know how to describe it. Is it is really soft, as you can tell. <laughs> I'm evil, Chiggy. Who is it? Chicken that shirt, like, can you tell how fast his little nose is moving? <laughs> Chicken's gonna arch his back, watch. <laughs> Chicken, it's okay. Can we smell it? It's okay. It's okay. I don't want you scared of the cuddle clone. <laughs> The eyes are really good. That's one of the reasons he's so freaked out, I think. <laughs> Chiggy! Oh, Bub, Chiggy got scared. But you? You can get it. Ram, <laughs> ram. Charlie's never scared him much. Whoa, well, does it look like you? What do you guys think? I'll try to get a front on with him. If I can't get it in this footage, I'll try to get a photo. All right, let's go in for some close-ups. So the ears, as you can tell, have different colors on them. And then the eyes and the whiskers. The nose is a little bit different, and obviously the, the blaze is a little bit different. And then all of that. 
Hello Charlie's fur, the feet, those are separated. Um, the tail has kind of a stiffness to it, if you will. The back is so good. I mean, literally, I would think that was Charlie looking out the window. You're still scared? It's okay. Is it scary when something comes to the house and it looks like a kitty, but doesn't smell like a kitty? Golly, how come they didn't make a cold clone of you? God, it's rude. I would say Trig think it, thinks it's legit. Look at his tail. This is so evil of me, but I want to take the cuddle clone and, and like move it really fast towards him. Trig the entire thing <laughs> Look at his tail. Oh, Chiggy. He's been introduced to the cuddle clone about 40 minutes ago. He's very scared of it. Only when it's facing him. <laughs> that was such a good hiss. One more. Just do one more hiss. That was good. Shaggy. What is it, Shaggy? What is it? It's okay? It's fake? It's okay? I brought the cuddle clone over to my parents' house to see how, uh, what are their names? Camus. Okay, Camus <laughs> react to seeing it to see if, you know, Trig hiss and stuff. We'll see what they do. So here we go. So the Camus and Murphy are down here. And we'll put this over here. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Bo, what's this one? Bo. <laughs> Just like Charlie, not even slinky back. <laughs> so no, no big deal there. Mom, mom didn't think that either. These are my mom's cats, uh, my parents' cats. But mom didn't think that either one of her cats would, would hiss, and so. Um, knew you guys. I know you. It's it's their time for treats, so they're not really into this whole thing. But what's this one? <laughs> my butt. He's like, hey, it's Charlie Cuddlecoat, smell my butt. There we go. <laughs> what do you think, guys? <laughs> What's he now? <laughs> it's when they see the eyes. Um, but he's still better than Trig. Yeah, he's a little slinky though. Well, because I did that. <laughs> and very, it. very stretched out. Nui, what is it? Ooh, it smells so funny. So the cuddle clones are made with um, synthetic plush fabric and it's supposed to be completely safe for cats um, to smell and stuff. Cuddle clones aren't toys. They're not um, they're, they're pretty much for display or like put on your bed purposes. They aren't something that, you know, you, you buy for your cat to play with or buy for your dog to bite. Um, they wouldn't hold up. Yes, yeah, mom was right. Neither one of them hissed. Somebody asked me how soft they are. Like, are, are they as soft as a stuffed animal? And they are pretty soft, but that's me pushing pretty hard. Um, so I'd say somewhere in between like a really soft stuffed animal to like a regular one. Uh, yeah, there it's all. And then the tail has some sort of wiring in it so that it holds that position. All right guys, so you can order your own cuddle clone and I will include a link below to where you can just click on through to order it. And then we have a coupon code it's um, Floppy Cats 10 and it will give you 10% off. So I'll include that too. Sometimes it has to change. So if it doesn't work, I'll have the new one in the about section or in the comment section. And then that if you want a Charlie Cuddle Clone, you can now get one. Now that a Charlie Cuddle Clone has been made,
you can buy one through Cuddle Clones if you want. The only thing is, is that you have to go through me to get it, so just send me an email and say, hey, I'm interested in a Charlie Cuddle Clone, and then I'll get you in touch with Cuddle Clones um, to have one made. All right, guys, in the comments below, let me know what you think about our Charlie Cuddle Clone, and also um, I'll include a link to our ordering videos. This one was a little bit different, where we ordered it online first, went through all the process of that, where our, you know, taking I had to take photos of Charlie from each side, and then they put it together according to the the photos. It's pretty amazing, actually, that they can put together something that's three dimensional from some two-dimensional photos. So I'll include a link to that so you can see what the ordering process is like and grab one for your kitties um, or of one of your kitties or one of your dogs. They can do animals that have passed. Um, you just have to email them and, and show them what photos that you have to see if they can make that happen. I did ask them to make this little pink spot right here on his mouth because Charlie has that. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It helps our channel grow and helps me bring you more reviews like the Charlie Cuddle Clone. We'll see you next time. This is my parents' um, one-year-old German Shepherd, and this is uh, him seeing the Cuddle Clone's Charlie for the first time. <laughs> I was kind of scared that he'd like be aggressive towards him. But yeah. All right. Well, pass. He's breathing so hard because we just ran him with a frisbee. Good boy, Parky Parky. Alright, Parks. Good boy. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> Chiggy and the Cuddle Clone standoff. Chiggy, I'm gonna say hi, that's your new friend, it's okay? Chiggy. Chiggy, go say hi, it's your new friend. Oh, Chiggy. Gonna love that co clones. Gonna love that co clones, Cheek. Way too scared of it. <laughs> okay, what if we do this? So it doesn't, it's the eyes that freak Chiggy out. And remember he has nystagmus or nystigmus or however you say it, where his irises go like that. So he doesn't see perfectly clearly all the time. Che. Che, go smell it. Is it freaking you out, Chiggy? We'll see how Chiggy does getting to know his cuddle clone. His Charlie cuddle clone. Chiggy, and then it wouldn't be so scary. Chiggy, you're gonna kill that kitty's. Chiggy, go kick that kitty's butas. Go, Chiggy, go see him. Go see him, Chiggy. My battery's about to die, so I hope it doesn't. An ex boyfriend of mine, whenever his cat acted like this, would do a high pitched kissing uh, noise, which would just make her jump straight in the air and back five feet. I'm inclined to do that now, but I think I'd get punished by the...